Hey there everyone, welcome to Technician. In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly make dependent drop down list. That is, let's say that you select division NFC North. In this cell, you will have the teams which play in NFC North and you can select any one of them. And let's say you select AFC South. You can then select any team from here. Let's see how to do this. Here is the list of different NFL divisions and the teams playing for each division. Let's say that you want to make a dependent drop down list. That is, depending on the division you select, you want to select one of the four teams in that division. There are multiple ways to do this. Today, I'm going to show you the one using XLOOKUP. So, let's begin first by creating a data validation list for the division side. To do that, let's select the cell D6 to D15, which is the division cells for a table, and then go to the data in the ribbon menu and look for data validation. Here, we can select in the validation criteria as a list, and the source. All we need to do is just select the header of our divisions, which is from cell H5 to O5, and then press enter and say OK. That's it. We can now select our different divisions based on our list in our main table. Let me just format them. I'm just going to go to bold, increase some size, and just center so we are able to select the different divisions in our cells in column d what we would like now is for a team drop down list which is dependent on our divisions to do that let's first try x lookup formula on a different cell so i'm going to pick up cell h13 and type in the formula equal to x lookup of the lookup value what we want to look up is our cell D6 and our lookup array is going to be our division titles which is from cell H5 to O5 and our return array is going to be our teams list which is going to be from cell H6 to O9 and we can close our formula and when you press enter there you will get the NFC East list on this cell. So let's say if I change the division to AFC North, I get all the AFC North teams in our output. Great. All we need to do now is to make this list as our data validation list. And now it's very simple. We know the formula and now we are going to use this type of formula for our data validation. So let's select our column E, that is the teams from E6 to E15 and then go to the data tab and select data validation. And here we are going to use a list, but in the source now we are going to type in the formula, which is going to be equal to X lookup of, we need to first put in our lookup value, which is going to be cell D6. Then, we need to select the lookup array, which is going to be our cell H5 to O5. Note that we need to fix these references because for each division, our header is going to be the same. And then our return array is going to be from cell H6 to O9. Again, it needs to be fixed because for all our rows, we need to have the same return array. And close in your brackets and just say enter. Let me just delete this. So now when you selected AFC not, you'll have the AFC not teams as your team list. For NFC South, I can choose Carolina Panthers, and let's say the second one I choose Tampa Bay Buccaneers. 
If you note in cell E9, I have a drop down list, but nothing is going to show up because I haven't selected the division yet in cell D9. And as soon as I select, let's say AFC South, I will get the four teams and I'm going to choose the Jacksonville Jaguars. Dependent drop down list can be really helpful when you need to do selection based on multiple lists. I hope that this tutorial was of use to you. If you liked it, please subscribe to my channel. Till next time, ciao.